Welcome back. The coronavirus pandemic has put a stop to heartfelt traditions, but there's one police officer who is determined to still offer a helping hand one meal at a time. NBC6 reporter Marissa Bagg joins us live in Pembroke Pines with this awesome story. Hey, Marissa. Hey there, Roxy. Yeah, this fun tradition had very humble beginnings for Pembroke Pines Police so many years ago, but it's going to look really different this year because of the pandemic. But as you're about to see, it's still spreading hope and goodwill at the start of a new year. For the first time in 27 years, Pembroke Pines officer Dean Subasis isn't going to work on New Year's Day, not in uniform or with an apron on. Every year since 1994, he's been the chef at Dino's Diner, a little pop-up eatery in his own home where he's fed his brothers and sisters in blue who had to work on New Year's Day. It all started out feeding just eight people. As the years gone by and, you know, we've city's gotten more populated. We've hired a lot more officers and service aides and civilians. And anybody on duty is welcome to come over. And it just got to be so many people that I needed help cooking. So I recruited my dad. In recent years, he and his father fed a full breakfast to 86 people. But like so many other traditions that were put on hold this year, Dean decided to forego the diner, saying it's the safest option during the pandemic. But he didn't have to abandon his eagerness to serve meals altogether. A couple of days ago, he bought all the food he usually buys to make breakfast for his colleagues and donated it to the Broward Outreach Center in Hollywood. I wanted to keep it going somehow so that we could at least say we didn't cancel it. We're still feeding people. We're still using the food that we would have bought anyway. Just different people are eating it now and people that could use it more than we can. So although he won't be the one frying bacon and eggs on Friday, hungry people will get fed. He hopes it inspires others to give back. If you have the ability to help someone out, give them a hand. Uh, from the littlest thing possible, you know, you might make a difference in someone's life. So Officer Subasis hopes to be back in Dino's Diner on New Year's Day in 2022. By then, he will have been with the department for 30, 30 years and 28 of them giving back to the community. Reporting live in Pembroke Pines, Marissa Bag, NBC6 News. A great story, great cause, Marissa. Thanks.